Good morning. I've been absolutely inundated with one direct message on Twitter to review some of the cars that are in our workshop. So let's go and look at a Mini Super 2. So here is the Beastly Beast. This is car 325, belonging to Mr. Robert Pellet. If we look under here, we can see... Oh my God, someone's stolen the engine! Mini Super 2 is obviously a full contact sport, so it has bumpers for the bumping. You'll notice there's no suspension in here. Anyone that races Rebels will know what that feels like. It does make for a bumpy ride, but an exciting one nevertheless. Very neat rack and pinion steering. And only two pedals, much like you'd have in a go-kart. The cab's pretty roomy. Just a steering wheel, no dials to worry about. Switch panel over there. Butler seat, much the same as what you'd find in any stock car. Six-point harness. Mirror. Again, there's no suspension at the back. We take off the back panel. You'll find a motor, much the same as you'd find in our pro car, something like that. Centrifugal clutch, chain drive, single disc brake on the back, and a car axle. Fuel tank is up there, quite small as you can see. Much more economical to run than a Brisker F1 car. That pretty much is a Mini Super 2.